Ooh, Justice Bringer, though. Once returned when a special summon monster your opponent controls activates its effect, you can negate the activation. Well, that just destroys my entire deck randomly out of nowhere. Who on? Ooh, man, that's a that's a randomly savage. I just got savaged by Justice Bringer. Say pendulums are irrelevant. Say pendulums can't compete with us. Decks like Cosmo, but um, the pendulum mechanic itself is still like the epitome of bullshit. Like when you get a new mechanic and that mechanic instantly becomes tier one, almost debatably tier zero. And when you have like strong decks that compete with it, like Pepe and Monarch were like um, sorry, Cosmo and Monarch were strong decks, but when Pepe came out, that just like that demolished them. It's crazy, but, um... No, yeah. It was Rank 4 Spam Deck, but it was enabled through the Pendulum Summon. Like, if you didn't have the Pendulum Summon, Sorcerer was garbage. And, like, no other Rank 4 Spam Deck was even competing with Cosmo and Mark at that time. Like, Clown Blade wasn't doing crap. Um, Light Scorn are a pretty decent Rank 4 Spam Deck. They weren't doing crap. And you could say that's because they got edged out by, uh... What do you call it? You could say it's because they got edged out by Pepe, but still. That just shows you how far above everything else pendulums are in terms of just generating advantage, you know? Now you can try and dismiss them as a rank 4 spam deck all you want, but the fact that they were the freaking... I played Pepe too, man. It was an easy deck to play. I played Pepe, I played Drago Pals, I played, uh, I played all that crap. But um, that just shows you how far above everything else that, that deck was, man. Like, when you have a rank 4 deck competing against Cosmo, that's crazy, man. That's like, this is like, a little bit... Guarded Treasure, oh my god, what? <laughs> guarded Treasure. Oh lord. What has life come to? No, yeah, Pepe was something else, man. The deck was spooky. Spooky scary. Alright, well, whatever. Strong first turn from Fabelwoods, as usual. This deck is so garbage. I went 5-1 and one with Magnet Warriors, Tech in Ties of the Brethren. I was so stoked, my dudes. No, did you use that one card that, like, limits you to one summon per turn? Clown Blade do wasn't doing anything because Chain was banned. Yeah, you can say that, but, uh... You can say that, but it still couldn't beat Pepe. I mean, come on. I'm... St I'm st I mean, come on. Come on. You know you're just cheating yourself. You know you're just lying to yourself. Shatner, why are you ignoring me? I'm keeping the stream PG9. Come on. Let's uh let's be fair here. Let's keep the stream PG9. Unmodded Shatner making fun of BF Hans. Unmodified. What? Oh, unmodified. Like unmodified. Alright, so if I can summon Trish before he Oh, this guy's about to get wrecked. Unless he has Solemn Strike, in which case. Uh, rank 4s were also more busted at that time, yet yeah, you had, um, Ptolemyus. Oh my god, Forbidden Chalice, what is life? Uh, but Ptolemyus is really the only difference between then and now, you know. It's not like we had radically different card pools. I think I can even attack over Avian at this point, so unless he's playing, like, Fiendish Chain, which he very well might be. I think we're good. Okay. Oh no, he plays that one. <laughs> Whoops. Oh no, if that's safe zone, we're about to get locked. But I will say that plush was garbage, uh, plus fire was garbage card design. Oh my god, I'm not even talking about plush fire. Yo, the plush fire Ariadne build made me want to puke every time I saw it, man. Like, you can say Ptolemyus was the problem, but like, plush fire made the plays, man. You can't, uh, you couldn't have had Ptolemyus spammed to the level you did without plus fire. It was... It was crazy. Like, oh man, when you opened up Plushfire and Draco, and that Draco guy, uh, what's his name, Luster? Ooh. Uh, I, no, no, no. You can't say that, man. That's, that's some, uh, that's making excuses right there. Pe the pendulum mechanic was one million percent badly designed. Told him this was terrible and I ran it and everything. Oh yeah, of course. Like, if you think I wouldn't be running Ptolemyus and Fable, you're, you're lying to yourself, man. Like, Ptolemyus is my homie. Like, without Ptolemyus, there is no love. 
But when Push Fire was banned, Drago Slayers just filled that emptiness. Yeah, I mean, yeah. But they couldn't spam to the level they did. You can't say that Draco Pals was even comparable to Full Power Pepe. And yeah, you can argue that was because Luster also got banned, I uh, got limited, but Draco Pals just never had the same level of just pure power that Pure Pepe did before it got hit. Like, when you have Pure Pepe compared to Draco's Pals, it's like night and day, man. Like, Draco Pals, sure, they had the uh, Majestic spam and they had the, uh, the rank 8 spam, but oh no, oh bother. Imagine plush fire with metal pros. That's I, I'm retching just thinking about that. That would be some crap to get right now. Just the power of pure I've come here to save you, and I can already taste your kill. Like caressing an angel, burning up in the atmosphere, and with the blood of a dying star. Don't let me be Oh my god, he had, I didn't even see the Justice Bringer. <laughs> Yo, that surprise Justice Bringer gets me every time. <laughs> Yo, what a terrible card. Sup, nerds, guess who's not dead? You. Get Rex Uh, BF Pawns, I'm guessing. <laughs> like, just being honest here. To answer your question, yes, I did use the card that allowed one attack, and it. No, not the card that allows one attack, the card that allows one summon. That card. Pendulums didn't restrict our summons like Pleas and Zephyrs are what made Pendulums good. Minus two scales worth it for special summon. Yeah, and, and like when your scales are like plush fire Ariadne, that's not even a neg two, man. That's like that's like just straight garbage. <laughs> now Pendulums become generic AF and RIP, I know man. Oh my god, Justice Bringer new meta. <laughs> Justice Bringer, man, what a card. Please restricted summoning. Yeah, no, he's saying no. You freaking illiterate scumlord. Uh, X play. No wonder you play Teller Knights. He's saying pendulums that don't restrict your uh, their summons, like Klee and Zephyr, restrict their summons. You know. By the way, we just lost. We put this guy in attack mode. Rip. Uh, oh yes, I did. My bad. I'm tired. I'm tired too. You get drawn to desynchro ASAP. No. All right, rip. Play tag duels with Klee? Ooh, hell yeah. Oh no, we lost because of Justice Bringer rip. Yo, Justice Bringer, is that card like from, inv from Invasion of Vengeance? Why are people, uh. Why are people playing that? Oh, he got the Regeki. Rip. So we were. Oh no, the Justice Bringer disrespect. Your Yu Gi Oh background? Hell yeah. Yo, we're paying respects. I finally found my time. 